game, still he's doing Wario. Yeah, I've been playing with Feathers with his Wario. It is nasty. Wario in this game. Don't worry, I got this. Speed. Commentary boy! Uh, let's go. No talking to myself like a crazy person. Yeah, so called to so I'm um, Right now we got the Battle of the Floaties. Yeah, basically. Like the two highest airspeed characters in the game, right? Yeah. Now, Yoshi and Wario. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, this is going to be pretty fast paced. Yeah. So, the one advantage I will say is that Yoshi. Uh, Nick. Or the tag is fast guy. Cast guy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, because both of them are really fast and a lot of aerial ability, so I feel like this is gonna be a really good spacing war. Yeah, basically, like Yoshi has the eggs to kind of like make space, but like, Wario has such high speed. Yeah, he'll get it. Like, he you're is, not gonna keep him out for long. Yeah, because it's definitely something where like both characters, even though that they've got great air speed, they also have some pretty stubby like normal attacks. So it's more so just trying to create with scout air air. I see uh, Super Yoshi do a lot of like down bees out of shield. I guess it's mm -hmm. Ooh, it's Yep. Alright, looks like that down air is punishable on shield. Uh, on the egg. Mm -hmm. and, uh, what happened? Like, Super Yoshi is not taking the turn. Yeah. He has Wario, even though like his solo, like hit for hit, aren't really that much damage. But usually a lot of it's more so since he has right here speed to try a pressure after each hit. Yeah. Because after each one, it's sort of like you're playing like a 50 50 each time if it's not true. Basically, like Wario has to get his like, you know, the second hit in there or something like that. Mm -hmm. But once he gets the combo started, it's a lot of damage. Yeah. And then it's just more so after like his first like falling near to like up air. Then yeah. it's sort of like, then the rest isn't really true, but you're in a really bad spot. But you're looking at the way that Troy's playing, or Super Yoshi's playing, like, he is not letting him get started on Yeah. Like a lot of his hits have been like one and done. Mm -hmm. He's playing his matchup exactly how it should. Mm -hmm. All right, Scully's looks like he's trying to get in. Yeah, has it in the situation, but uh, Troy gets back down to the back air. Yeah, it's way better in this game. Yoshi's back air. Tech guy represent. Mm -hmm. Tech guy. <laughs> the stream master. Behind yep. Us. And I feel like a lot of this might just come down to neutral play for both these people because since both of them do have really good air mobility and not really too much disjoint, yeah. they have to be really precise if they want to like follow up or like keep advanced state. Mm -hmm. Like Wario is really kind of rushing in on you, mm -hmm. but if you have a higher air speed than him, how is he going to do that? Yeah, especially when he's trying to follow you in the air. He is not like him like this wide arc in space, but I command this one. It's like just like right up on top of him, he has to command it. Yeah. Alright, alright. Like, like, nah, I'm just in line for the bathroom. Alright. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the commentary is actually the bathroom, like, the one in the same. <laughs> and this one of those things where, like, deep down, like, in Troy's head, I mean, Super Yoshi's head, it has to be in it that solely has WAP. Like, you know that he's probably gonna be looking for it on yeah. this side. It's at max charge right now, I believe. Yep. Yeah. Because he hasn't used it all match. Yep. So, right now he's sitting pretty on it. Because you sort of know that he wants to try to use it around now. Oh. Or. Alright. Because it's either about now and you'll have about half off, like when most of them will be on kill percent, or he's just saving it for like his final stop. Yeah, what is it, like two minutes, three minutes before yeah, charge? Is so I think it is. Yeah, Wario is, yeah. so his air speed and his run speed is just ridiculous. Yeah. Ooh, oh! Nice. Like, look at that. Taking advantage of the speed that he has, he went like quarter stage. Yep. Yoshi's you know, like forward air on back on. He's yeah. able to get that uh, first that speed. And now it's an even game. Yeah. And oh, he saved yeah. the block. All right. Nice amount of damage. Yeah. So it was worth it in the end, even though he didn't kill. Yeah. Worth knowing that fully charged swap is actually not the strongest swap there is. It's actually the one right before, right? Yep, the one right before. Uh, I don't even know the timer for it. I'm not a warrior. Man. I'm not a warrior main either. <laughs> but I do know that that Yoshi down B is a really. Oh! Yo, Soli with the comeback. Yep. Yeah, once he got like in charge of the momentum mm -hmm. the match, he just took Yoshi for a ride. Yeah. Because I feel like the first sock might have just been like feeling the characters out because mm -hmm. I don't really think there's many Warrior or Yoshi players really out there. So it's sort of like, yeah. how I do mean, I combo you? I mean, we have, uh, you know, Spiro, uh, Spyro, mm -hmm. Spiro, how do you say it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but outside of local play more. So, like, even yeah. online, it's really hard to find, like, either of these two characters. Mm -hmm. Wario, I definitely see rising in popularity, especially yes. after Tweaks run. Mm -hmm. Here they go again. Another one, uh, Super Yoshi opted for the pink color yep. counter pick. Well, in fact, Super yeah. Yoshi always says random colors because after he's done, he like rapidly matches it. Yeah. And whenever he was hit start, that's a color. That's his trademark. His, yep. his color is every color. Yeah. 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 <laughs> 
Can you tell us the same way? Yeah. Oh man, yo, Sony's really starting. Yeah, Sony's really starting yeah, yeah. really start to feel up, feel himself in this match. Yeah. Like he's doing everything he right. Not do that in public. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Only in game. Yeah, yeah. Time yeah. Allowed. But yeah, right now, uh, 124 to 75. Yeah. Is this one of those percentage where like? It's definitely like one thing where you already know that like, Wario is finally getting close to the point where the famous back here, the slap might kill. Mm -hmm. And then with Yoshi, it's more so forward air, up air is going to be able to confirm, maybe looking for. Or down B. Yeah, there you go. Not only is it a good kill move at those percents to punish like unsaved shield pressure, it also does so much shield damage that, that if someone shields a single over the beam, no break. Yeah, you have to spot dodge it. Mm -hmm. uh, that's the best way to punish it after this. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, back to two spots. Yep. Looking pretty even. Yep. Yeah, these guys are neck and neck. Yeah. And if I'm so and my opponent wants to try to play the semi camping game, I'd be down. Because while you're doing that, like the WAP timer is what subconsciously makes people have to approach. Yeah, that's true. Even though Warrior doesn't have projectiles per se, the fact that his WAP exists. Yeah, especially if the uh, Wario is more liberal on when he's going to use WAP, because then it's like, alright, once he has it, it's like, bam. Yeah, the longer you wait, the stronger that WAP is going to be, so I mean, you gotta yeah. approach it. Yeah, knowing that still, you still have to play that safe game. Anyway. Yeah. So I'm going to put guard on. That's an egg up smash. Yep. Easy damage. It's like he out of it. Yeah, because that's the one thing. The first button that you press out, like the slot mashing and hold, that will be the button that you buffer out your mash. The uh, bag like. So we well, have pretty good Nair as of like out of bag off and out of field yep. off and everything. Alright, to get up attack from the mm -hmm. yeah, Yep, and right now, I feel like both characters... Oh, back air killing off the top. Yeah, back air is so good now. It's yeah. Like, like, safe on shield, you're laying with it, you're mm -hmm. with it. I'm so glad they made it good. Right? Yeah. That's what was a little bit underwhelming. Yeah. Especially since there was like, it was that weird in between where like sometimes the hits wouldn't hit because the re hit rate was slower or so. But also had too much landing lag so people couldn't combo like drag down. Yeah. Or you know, tying the game up with the dash attack. I'm yep. so glad you didn't do the shoulder bash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so happy. I'm glad that even though PM's gone, they finally took that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they took a lot of notes. We had a lot of yeah. Coincidence? Mm hmm. But also, this is also where Wario can shine his low percent combos. Yeah. One up tilt leads to a lot. Oh, looks like I think yeah. he needs a strong hit. I, yeah, I think he might also just want to be saving it. The more so, like, have that back of, I could kill you with this. Because right. right now, I'm pretty sure that WAP from, like, any part of the stage will kill. At 67? Actually, yeah, at this percentage. It's and actually very dangerous. Oh, Ooh. what a forward smash! On the side of the stage is enough to kill. Yep. Alright, that's the one one. Mm -hmm. This is our best of five, right? Yep, this is best of five. So, I'm wondering if uh, Stoney's gonna choose to stay in the same character. Mm -hmm. He is known to swap around. Yeah. But I feel like Wario did pretty good. That yeah. Character. The only thing that I would guess is that if he would switch, maybe a sword character like Ike. Yeah. Because that way you don't have to more so worry about boxing, but... Oh, is he gonna play Dark Stannis? Oh, he's gonna play Dark Stannis. Ooh. Yo, let's go. Mm -hmm. The better Samus. Yeah. Actually, like, really, real talk, also, probably the better Samus just because since there's no key differences outside of she's just smaller, she lets... Yeah, she crouches let, a little bit, right? Really. Uh, that and her normal height send, is, like, a little bit smaller than Samus, so she can hit smaller enemies. Yeah, her missiles also hit more, so they, it's better yeah. on short characters, too. Yeah. And her double jump, she's kind of, like, crouching yeah. a little bit. Yeah, feel like a boss doing that. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. <laughs> Even if it was just costumes alone, Dark Sand Soul. Yeah. <laughs> like just the costumes and even animation look a lot more bad. A lot definitely cool. Yeah, Samus in this game is pretty good. Like most people haven't been talking about it. But mm -hmm. he has some good stuff. That and I feel like the same with Yoshi. Yeah. Because a lot of people are like, well Yoshi is like like they'll show like the up tilt not hitting like yeah. see this character sucks. Like, no, 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 he was just going to do yeah. some stuff. He may have lost Jab 1 into Imagination, but he also, <laughs> with the new mechanics, along with the new egg, he definitely can have an impressive juggling situation. Yeah. Yo, you know what uh, Jimmy told me before? Mm -hmm. when I was like, fully charged uh, Samish charge shot, fully charged, it was 31%. Yeah. Jesus, 
so much damage. Oh yeah. 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 Oh yeah, the one you won bonus, that's probably it. Yeah, yeah. Everyone did a lot of damage. Yeah. The only allies to that is like Sheik. That's Basically, the character that'll be yeah. doing 4% for a forwarder. <laughs> it was like, alright, this looks like Smash 4, honestly. Basically. <laughs> yeah. Alright, Sheik, please. Yep. And that's also one thing also to know of. Usually, a lot of like shield pressure, like what makes a move safe or unsafe on shield, is the amount of damage that we'll be doing. Because then that calculates like, shield sum. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the other attacks. Well, so. All right, all right, all right. It looks like, I don't know, Troy looks pretty comfortable yeah. in this match. Like, he, Samus isn't giving them too much trouble. Yeah. He is usually, like, with all, with most of the zoners, they more so seem like they get the one, two piece hit combos and then it's like reset back into neutral. Yeah. Or at least with Wario, he, would, he wouldn't really send Troy flying, but it was close enough to a point where you could punish bad options, like trying to fight back out this man. Yeah, Wario takes a, a lot of advantage of momentum when he gets into the mm -hmm. but since, uh, zone is like Samus, not the so much. Yeah. But right now, yeah, Troy's looking pretty good. Yeah. Like, there's, uh, Stoli's already on his last spot. Mm -hmm. And right now, I don't know. Yeah. Like, this may just be a thing, but I'll like, try to have to <laughs> Oh. Accidentally do it with mm -hmm. shot. Yeah. And honestly, I think uh, Yoshi's better than Samus. Mm -hmm. I'm being honest, cause like yeah, like Yoshi can command more respect, like her area, than just like one line, which is the char shot. Basically, cause you have the eggs, right, which is one thing, right? But then yeah. You have Yoshi's air speed, so you can weave them in out. Uh, Samus is mm -hmm. kind of you know, stuck. That, and you can also angle the eggs and let them bounce off the stage. And there's a lot more than all right. If you swung an egg, it's going at this angle all the time. Yeah, there's a lot more. Than Oh, oh that's, that's unfortunate. unfortunate. Alright, so Super Yoshi 2. Mm -hmm. Yep. But even more. regardless of that, you can definitely see that both from Harry's are smiling, laughing yeah. it off, oh, no, having a yeah. good time. These guys have versed each other more than like anyone else. Mm -hmm. Especially in tournaments. That's yeah. I'm pretty sure like in the last like couple months they've versed each other three times. In the best of five in tournaments. So. Yeah. It's that and both players are honestly most friendly like in bracket like i can play with both those in bracket and feel like i'm actually having a conversation while playing yeah basically <laughs> first, and it's like one of those things where it's like it's off playing at first but then it's like a welcome thing where it's like oh this is nice <laughs> yeah it depends there's like two types of players one is like dead silent yeah like, has the headphones on blocking yeah, everything <laughs> 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 no, i'm the same way so, same oh yeah like, oh wait what Do I Dr. Mario versus Ooh. I didn't even see the character switch. Same. Like, I can only say in the dark, he has totally has been, like, definitely saying this. But Troy, I remember playing him before, he was like, yeah, you know, I want to try out Dr. Mario. And whoa, that actually looks like an actual combo right there. Yeah, it is. Uh, according to Stoli, it's a confirm. Like, you can get that there too. Paltina, like, people have been saying she's pretty good. Yeah. Although her ground game is a little bit lacking, I would say. Mm -hmm. Like, if she had better ground game, I would, I would agree with her. Uh, oh, on the hype? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right now, like, she has to be there. Like, yeah. That, and a lot of Paltina is more so, like, she doesn't really seem to have, like, good air airs that are, like, good on shield. It's more so, alright, I have to be falling with forward air. For, yeah, falling or with back air. That's literally all she has. Or if I do use... Neutral air, it has to be a cross off. Basically. Meanwhile, Doc, I'm pretty sure I'm not 100% like, confident that his rising back here might still be safe on shield. The enemy is so strong. Yeah. So not only that, but Bakumar has been getting some nice stuff. According to Soya, also has one of the strongest back airs in the game. Back, if we're throws, th back throw. If we're talking base, you know, not talking shield throw right here. I mean, Literally, Smash it's Cinemore, Dr. Mario. Yeah. Like, what? Where did that come from? What happened to Ness? Yeah. All right, Got bumped down to number three. Yeah. And right now, yes, Lily's looking pretty good. Yeah. Strongest base. Yeah. Right now, Stoli has a hundred yep. percent Which, Palutena can bring this back because Palutena is known for a low percent jump. And, ooh. In this situation, it's pretty dangerous because Palutena is on her last half. Yeah. Some pretty good like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Dude, they, like they'll play completely different. They play so many yeah. characters it's hard to tell. If you look away you won't you won't know what the Yeah. Yeah, that's the 
that's kind of the nature of these two players. Yeah. Especially against each other, they'll always play. Yeah. Like, some random matchup. Because it gets to the point where like you fall each other so many times where it's like, you know what? I can probably like have the info and be able to play out this matchup. Basically. Oh, back throw. Oh, man. And that Honestly, was a really strong call, especially with the new shield mechanics. Like, you can't run through someone's shield. We need it. was like, call, you're going to spot dodge the roll. I already know this. Yeah. Because if you didn't spot dodge, like, you wouldn't have got the cross. Yeah, up. you would have just <laughs> been, like, pushing him <laughs> closer in the corner. <laughs> yep, we got match point. We're at game five. I wonder if is Troy going to take it seriously? Yeah, yeah, straight to Yoshi. Mm -hmm. You already know. <laughs> This Dr. Mario is serious. Do not yeah. sleep on him. Like, he does a lot of damage. He can kill you yeah. pretty early. He has his up air string. Mm -hmm. What else can he can do if you're not like careful? Yeah, and it definitely feels like, unlike his fast forward, where he doesn't really have that much kill problem. He has, it's alright, say that you're around like 120%. Alright, if I get a grab, you're dead. Basically, yeah, now that he has like a really viable kill throw option, yeah, like, it, it changes the game. Yeah, it makes it so, alright, I can just sit in the shield, and if I get grabbed, not too bad. Now you have to worry about his back air, his grabs. Basically, a lot of out of shield options that you do now. Yeah. And uh, up B, I think he said it's slightly slower in this game, but it's still a very good like, yeah. escape option. A lot of the time, it's very slow escape option. Mm -hmm. Right now, it was, yeah, this choice is doing much better in yeah. this matchup, I'd say. Right now, Yoshi can like, take it better than speed. Yeah. Like, Ooh, man, yeah, let's stop that thing. Yeah. yeah. So much damage. Like, it's down for like, a Ooh. Mm -hmm. right. Yep. This is the tech. Well, it's, it's more so not like a missed tech now. Now that grounded forward, like ground spikes, you can no longer attack them. Oh, so can. things like that are now consistent. Oh yeah, if, as long as you're on the ground. Yep. And then there even gets to some parts where if your launch speed is too fast, that you naturally is untackable. Yeah. So um, that's only towards like ultra high percent. Basically, and you'll know because there's like a red spark. Like yep. Ooh, the air to air forward air. Is there a name for that move? This should be. I feel like it, I think that like from Melee was actually named was like something PhD. Like I remember like his back air was the PhD drop kick. PhD drop kick. Yeah. You can't, you can't just put PhD in front of movement. It was either that or was no wait no it wasn't that it was drop kick PhD. Using the PhD punch, the PhD air dodge. See. Using the PhD jump. The PhD grab and the PhD up air. God pushes the doctor, my guy. How is will anyone know? <laughs> oh, yeah. It punishes that down beat with the forward air. Yep, and right now it's just trying to create a bunch of pressure off stage. The doc is pretty scary. Especially when you're by the ledge. Like, yeah. A lot of things can kill you. Like straight hits. Mm -hmm. And even right now, like guys, like you have to know, like right now, you have to look out for your forward air from Yoshi. You have to look out for up tilt because those are going to be the things that will lead into you dying. And right now, he also has to worry about touching his shield. He is down B for Yoshi out shield. <laughs> the, the triple parry into down B. Yeah. <laughs> It's one of those things where you parry twice and I'm like, alright, now what are you gonna do? Yeah. <laughs> well, like, even though parry projectiles isn't as strong because it doesn't freeze the other character. Yeah. It's like it sort of sends a message, we're like, yeah. alright, well, I guess this isn't gonna work. <laughs> yeah, basically. It, like, even though the awesome movement is just let him keep parrying. Yeah. Well, well alright, this may be like a five thing when we're gonna mess up sooner or later. Alright, back here, and uh, looks like 50% lead on the last stock game five. Yep. And now yeah, okay, so we get back on yeah. the is the question. And just if you can get back and you set the neutral, you might have a chance. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Alright. Yeah. How much damage he gets off of this? Yeah. Uh, not too much, 40%. Pretty decent. Like just the damage multiplier by itself can make it so just to be honest, you know, alright. You don't have any crazy distance or burst ups. So once you get it so close to the ground, you're only out.